to me doing the reaction thing to love death plus robots today's episode 10 it is titled shapeshifters and ooh yeah what is this like mission impossible is this some sort of siren slash humanoid sat slash um yeah hum humanoid could i don't know it could be anything reptiles <laughs> i don't know uh, shapeshifter could be just about anything, but man, this show is so exciting because uh, it just captivates you and hooks you with a, a sweet premise. They do feel very video gamey, shortsy, uh, like it, you almost feel like you're watching an intro and you're like you're ready to play it. Uh, I've been saying that as of late, uh, so I totally believe that every time I see it. So, all right, without further ado, let's do it. Let's do the reaction. Oh, we're uh, in uh, military. And, uh, wow, it's Call of Duty. He's got the powers. He's got the she codes. Wow. Oh, I get it. It's um. Yeah, I I kind of I get it. I get it. Yo, you guys are comrades. Why? What's with the hate? Is he really barking at him? Why is he growling at him? What the fuck? These are soldiers. See, that is very parenterotic. <laughs> that is very true. Look, man. You're not supposed to like every American, but you should be, you should at least enjoy your own country, you know? <laughs> Wait, so it's I just realized that they're never in the convoy. They're always walking behind or in the front. That's horrible. Yo, he, he cheesed it up there. Oh. Uh, wait, what if the enemy has a dog too? You know what I'm saying? Like, what's stopping them? Good lord. Holy shit, yo, you is dead, bro. Yo, this is awesome. Can you imagine playing a video game like this? Oh, he found him. Wait, what? Why did he... He didn't sell him out. Why did he... Okay. Maybe he just wants to fight him by himself.
Now, why is he naked? I, I don't really have much of a... Why is he naked? You know, I was about to say the same thing. Or, well, I don't even know why to say that. But I, anyway, I was literally about to say that, um, that, that the reason they're naked is because they're going to transform. You know, they're going to go all werewolf. Wait, it's two against one? Damn, he got destroyed already. Holy fuck. Damn, how are you going to fight with one hand? Oh, my God. Oh! Oh! Talk about a bite. Holy shit. Oh my god, look at his face. Oh. Oh. I mean, you pushed him way too hard. The price are not shooting him. What the hair? Hold up, hold up. Let's time out here. Um, first, this short is made by Blur Studio, and I'm so hyped for this particular short here because wow, that was fantastic. That was beautiful. Like, like I said in the beginning of the video, like these, these little shorts feel like a video game. It feels like like I'm ready to play like oh okay so we're we're supposed to hunt people we're sojourning in, in I don't know Midwest stuff or Mid East I don't know where that area is <laughs> but, but anyway I just I love the concept because when you take the story into a video game you know the whole sensing and smelling soldiers healing factor shooting fighting other people's or bosses characters like you uh and then the story itself is so captivating you're this werewolf or dog le le legit taking the concept of a dog soldier right uh anyway so you're like this werewolf and cool you can bring so many aesthetics here you can go extremely sci-fi you can add vampires zombies you name it um wow this it's so good like i i just wow that was fantastic i it just I can only imagine if this was a video game and give it like a uh, you know um, Metal Gear Solid 5 um, Phantom Pain kind of budget or even open world kind of aesthetic it would just be bliss or maybe that's just me overthinking but really enjoying the hell out of the show and its concept and its stories now be it this one I don't know where the robots part come in, but I can understand the love and death. <laughs> Maybe the two werewolf buddies had an, an affection for one another, or again, maybe it was just camaraderie with being soldiers and you know having that brotherhood, um, um, you know, essence with them. 
because uh, it, it doesn't necessarily always have to be like sexual it can always just be very platonic but my perception on it changes uh when uh decker right saw his buddy or like saw his buddy for the last time he kind of like touched him and <laughs> he gave him one last sniff because it's like what the what i guess maybe he just like i, I never want to forget how you smell and He's a dog. He's, I, whatever. So look, I say you peoples of the world, what do you guys think of today's episode? I'd love to hear uh, your thoughts, so leave them in the comment section. Uh, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and God bless you. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.